Hey folks, and welcome to the Australian Rock Show. My name is Dennis Gray from the Rockin' and Rollin' Gray Brothers. Now, I mentioned quite recently that we're gonna do um, some different things with this video channel, including reviews of some new releases. And folks, we're in luck because the first release we're gonna talk about is absolutely amazing. It's the brand new EP from the Rose Carlio Band, which is titled Battle Scars. Now, of course, long-time listeners of our show will remember that we interviewed Rose back on show number 10. So make an effort to listen to that so you can learn more about Rose and her musical journey so far. Uh, that interview was around the time that her Time Is Now album came out, which was a wonderful release. And trust me, folks, that particular title track, um, Time Is Now, will be stuck in your head for days. Super, super catchy. So obviously, I was very excited to get hold of the new release from Rose Carlio, and it does not disappoint. It is easily, as I've said before, going to be in my top five releases for this year, that is for certain. Now the EP opens up uh, with the song Into the Fray, which has a great riff that runs all through the song. And I can see why they kicked off the EP with this as it's so loud and gutsy. The bass line in this is courtesy of Steve King and gives it a somewhat of a little screaming Jets type of flavor. Um, really catchy chorus, right out of the gate. The intention is clear, this band mean business. Love it. Um, this lineup features some Australian rock and roll royalty. The aforementioned Steve King, who was in Rose Tattoo for many years. Um, from memory, he's also done time in the Pete Wells Band, uh, Lucy DeSoto, and the Handsome Devils, and Bitzer. Very rock solid uh, bass player. His rhythm partner on this release, and with a bunch of other outfits, is Mick O'Shea. Uh, mixed rock and roll resume is as long as your arm. Um, Judge Mercy, Dragon, Swanee, Thorpey, Ian Moss, Kevin Borich. Of course, he just filled the drum stool on the recent Richie Sambora Arianti tour. And word is that Mick was damn close to filling Phil Rudd's position on ACDC's Rock or Bus tour. So what you have there is pretty much one of the most potent rhythm sections treading the boards anywhere on the planet today, in my opinion. Mick Adkins is an accomplished lead guitar player and his sound is integral to the material on Battle Scars. Mick was, of course, in an outfit called the Rogue Sharks. Uh, their self-titled album from 2007 is well worth searching out if you have not heard it. Rose Carlio, of course, powerhouse songstress who has a knack of writing catchy songs. Songs, as I said, which make you feel good and ones which get stuck in your brain in the nicest possible way. More people need to be aware of her. Now, the title track on this EP uh, is Classy with a capital C and in a just world, should be the song which busts it wide open for Rose Carlio and her band. It's really, really infectious. And trust me, folks, 10 seconds in and you're hooked. I love songs that start with lead guitar, as this one does. I could reach for the thesaurus, but adjectives are not required. It's just great sounding rock and roll stuff which makes you feel good. Songs like this are ones which always I find myself turning up to and singing along to. They remind me of why I love music and why my love of rock and roll is so great and more people need to hear it. Coattail is another song which rocks and rolls along. A little nod to the glitter band in there maybe, which to these ears always sounds great. There is a tune on here called Faded Tattoo, dedicated to the memory of Peter Wells and Mick Cox. Thumping bass guitar all the way through, which really drives the song. Uh, it starts off slowly, but veers quickly into what I'd call blues-laced rock and roll with searing lead guitar. You know, these songs are very well crafted and you can tell there's been a lot of work put into this recording by Rose and her band. I like the production, but in saying that, I'm not one of those people who pour over the sound and, and the mix of an album. If it sounds good, I crank the volume and that's that. End of story. It's rock and roll, you know what I mean? Battle Scars, by the way, was engineered by uh, Russell Pilling. And if you are a fan of the, of the kind of guitar-fueled rock and roll which we dig, I bet you've got something in your collection which Russell has had a hand in. He's done stuff with a bunch of bands over the years. Too many to go through, but here are a few. Um, Hoodoo Gurus, Radio Birdman, Roddy Radar, The Vines, Died Pretty, The Church, New Christs, Celebrate Rifles, Asteroid B612, The Great Album In Heat by The Fools, circa 1998, 
Uh, he engineered that one. Pete Wells, 1991's um, record, Everything You Like Tries to Kill You, produced, of course, by Kevin Shirley, but engineered by Russell. Uh, he also did some work on the Crunch release from 1992. My brother really loved that band, was always singing their praises from memory. Um, Brian Mann and Mark Wilkinson were in that outfit. And finally, he engineered the killer 7-inch titled Chikudo Bar from Brother Brick, released on Dogmate in the early 90s. That's just some of the many artists he's worked with. Obviously, an experienced engineer with an impressive resume, which this release can now be added to. Um, another track, Last Day Alive, for me. That was the real surprise on this EP, and one which showcases just how raw and powerful Rose Carlio's vocals are. Take it as you find it, say it like you mean it, love it like you own it, live it like your last day alive. Indeed, love, love, love that one. Battle Scars is a stellar release, which more people need to hear. One part country, one part heavy blues, and one part loud pub rock. Feel good rock and roll guaranteed to liven up the gloomiest of days. Rose Carlio and her band have come up trumps, and I encourage you to purchase this, as I know if you're a fan of our show, or you just want a hit of some infectious rock and roll, this is going to be right up your alley. Okay, the band have some tour dates coming up. This Sunday, the 15th of April, they're on at the Bridge Hotel in Roselle in Sydney. Sunday, the 20th of May, they're at Tate's at Hawkesbury Hotel up in uh, Windsor there. Saturday, the 2nd of June, on at the Bald Face Stag at Leichhardt with special guests Rust from New South Wales and Roadkill from Tasmania. And Thursday, the 28th of June, you can get along to Frankie's Pizza in the city there. And what else we've got? Saturday the 30th of June, back at the Bridge Hotel at Roselle, 8 p.m. with special guests, 8-Ball Junkies from New South Wales. More dates to be announced soon. So the best place to find more information about Rose Carlio Band is head to rosecarlio.com. You can also head to rosecarlioband.com and Rose is on Facebook as well. Guys, Rose Carlio, Battle Scars, bye now and thank me later. This is Dennis, out.